Hello again. A fairly grisly Friday for large parts of the UK. If you don't like it grey and damp, most places just seeing thick clouds and outbreaks of rain on and off and it's getting quite breezy as well, but not everywhere. Some brighter skies, especially across parts of eastern England and particularly across the far southeast. Weather fronts slowly heading in and there's more to come as well. A whole daisy chain of weather fronts all lining up. Uh, to bring us spells of rain through the weekend and often quite blustery too. Here's that first spell of rain already set in across most of Scotland, Northern Ireland, Northern England. Further south, some brighter skies to start the day, but the cloud is all shifting in from the west. We should stay largely dry across the southeast, some dry spells for a time across the Midlands and the southwest, but the rain is edging in and uh, some of that will be on the heavy side, particularly over southwest Scotland where we do have a weather warning in force, but also over the hills and mountains of uh, Wales and western England. Quite a lot of rain to come uh, through the next 12 hours or so. But if you've got some brightness, it's uh, quite warm. Temperatures getting into the low 20s across the southeast. Generally, we're stuck in the mid to high teens, but turning increasingly humid as the, the breeze continues to strengthen, bringing in warm, moist air from the southwest. Through the evening, we'll continue with outbreaks of rain across the west. We'll see some patchy rain for a time across the east as well. It does turn clearer across Scotland, some clearer skies here, allowing temperatures to drop down into single figures. But uh, for most places, we're staying in the mid to high teens, really quite a, a humid feeling nights, misty and murky, uh, particularly on hills. So we start the weekend with a lot of cloud. We should see some sunny spells across parts of northeast Scotland. And through the day, Parts of the Midlands, eastern England may well brighten up with a bit of sunshine, but for the west it does stay rather drab with further rain and drizzle at times, again, particularly over the hills of Wales and uh, western England. A few showers coming into Scotland, but some fine weather here, as I said. Uh, the breeze will be perhaps a touch lighter through Saturday afternoon, but then going to strengthen further on Saturday nights, but still bringing that mild air. So if we see some sunshine, we could easily get, again, get up to 22 or 23 degrees, but where it stays cloudy, humid feels 17, 18, the top temperature. Through Saturday evening, again, many central and eastern parts just staying dry, but cloudy, a bit more patchy rain in the west. That fizzles out for a time, but look at this, another area of wet weather approaching and the wind starting to strengthen too. This is an area of low pressure. Now, this is yet to really develop and intensify, but there's a lot of uncertainty about the exact position of this low, but it could turn into quite a vicious little feature. And with the isobars squeezing together, it could bring some very strong winds for the time of year across parts of southern Scotland, Northern Ireland and Northern England. So there's a warning in force for these winds, gusts of 50, maybe 60 miles an hour, possibly a bit more if that develops uh, further. So as I said, there is some uncertainty, but if it does happen, these winds could cause some disruption. Southern Scotland, parts of Northern Ireland and Northern England. So that's something we're keeping a close eye on during the course of particularly Saturday night and into Sunday. So very windy on Sunday for the time of year, but it will also be turning fresher and less humid. And apart from a few showers, there should be um, lengthy dry and sunny spells for most of us on Sunday too. Keep up to date with the latest weather warnings by following the Met Office on social media. Or of course, you can download the Met Office 